This is real comic Hello. book talk. We're here to blast off. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Wow. So today, yeah. we are here to talk about the Christ yes, Jogger sir. Trailer, part two. All right, look. Uh, yeah, they got you. Got to let these people stay dead. I'm sorry. No, yeah, this is them comic them. book stuff. Yeah, boy. I, I get it. I get it. This is well, what bring Arrow back. A comic book. Bring Arrow no. back. Whoa, wait a no. hot second. Wait, that's is that an exception to the rule? No, no bull. First it is. It is. It is. <laughs> I, I know I'm not being fair, and I'm know I'm going. To, I know I'm being. I, I'm, it's a double standard. I know that. I don't care. That don't make it right. <laughs> I don't care. I, I know. I'm not one wrong for having a double standard. I know this. You don't have to. Say, oh my gosh, you got a double standard. You're not being this. I know that. I'm a I'm an arrow guy. I'm a defend arrow no matter what. I would I will find a way to defend seasons three or four if I had to. I would defend arrow. Bring him back. The rest of thirty Earth thirty eight. Oh yeah, I can go. Let's go. Wow. Don't bring him back, man. Let's make one universe. Let Arrow be in that final fight, battle scene, man. <laughs> no. Yeah. No. No. Yeah. But I thought if if yeah. if you're gonna bring Arrow back, then you might as well bring everybody else. No. Back. If you're gonna kill Arrow at the beginning and let the rest of the uh, heroes do None. what they have to do without him, that's great. That's good story writing. That that's the twist that everybody wants. I get all of that, and I'm not saying you're wrong. <laughs> I agree with you. What I'm saying is, it's a double standard nah. for me with Arrow, and that's how I just feel about it. I, I, I look, it is what it is. I understand it, but my thought. If you're going to bring Arrow back, you might as well bring everybody back because... No, I, you you're, well, you're absolutely right. What I'm saying is, I no, don't I like that. I, I do that. have a double standard with Arrow. No. The rest of 38 could die. Wow. It is what it is. One Earth. I mean, you can bring it back and, you know, just like the comments and it all comes back to One Earth. That's fine. But, or, or, just let them die. Just let everybody die. It's great. It's not like, it's not like Earth 1 has all these... Has a bunch of room out, out of nowhere. All these other people can make it. So. Yeah, so uh, Sarah Lance told the rest of the, uh, the boys from the Legends that they don't have to do any more crossovers. Yeah, that I was thought classic. that was hilarious. Yeah. Uh, so they classic had to go legends. get another. It's just, yeah, like, it's just like last, last year. We're yeah. not going to be in this We're one. We're not going to be in this meetup. Uh, so uh, they had to go get another time traveling jumping ship and. So what happens. Rory is in there writing love novels still. You, you rec- did you recognize the voice? Yeah, it was uh, Cole. Captain, Captain Cole. Cole. Captain yeah, because I, I couldn't recognize it for a second. I was like, it sounds so familiar. I know I should know this. And then he said something slick. I was like, that's Captain Cole. And he's the same jerk. I like this. I like it a lot. I like it a lot. Yes. And also, um, they sent everybody to a different earth. Uh, we got a lot to talk about. Okay, let's. Uh, where you guys want to start, Chris? We'll start with Superman, Clark Kent, uh, Smallville one, and he gave up his powers. Are like, you shocked? No. After watching it, I was like, huh, okay, okay, that's cool. Yeah. That's you cool. always said one or the other. That's what you said multiple times. You either be all, always be the hero, or give it all up and be a regular person. That's just that's like a common Daniel thing. But you, and you did. You're the one who did say. He probably didn't have his spot. Yeah. So yeah, we already knew that. That's yeah. why I, I don't know why he's jumping all over the place. <laughs> like, 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 yeah. Because you said this, dude. Because you, 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 you came out and you was like, like he, he gave up his powers. All right. And let's like, talk about it. Now don't, is, now don't jump on me. I was just talk about that's it. That's what we do here. That's what we do. But look, Superman always wants a family. And he feels that he can't have a family and try to save the world. Yeah, be Superman and have a family. Yeah, so I think all Superman, or majority of them, want to... Find some way to have a family and not have that power. Thirty eight anyway. did. He yeah, was right. Exactly. And I have no powers here. I'm just a regular guy. Yeah, so he gave up his powers too. Yeah, they just you got it. They want a family. They want kids. Well, you so. have that power. When Superman has the power, he has that urge to go save people. He has. Yeah. He, it's a responsibility for him. It's a responsibility to use the power and save people. But when you no longer have that responsibility, you got responsibility to be a dad. Yeah. So there you go. Lex Luthor was. Yes, it's you gave up your powers. You can fly. Yeah. He was like, yeah. "Oh, this is BS." Yeah, he yeah. was. But that's what, that's what he wanted, though. That's what I don't understand. He no, he don't want to. He don't want to. He wanted to destroy. He him. wanted to kill. Him. He wanted I'm to kill him, though. and he wanted the power. Yeah. He, he was. Uh, he, he was crazy. No, he is. He's he crazy. 
And yeah. that, that incident turned him in to say, you know what? Killer Superman is born. I just let them kill each other. That's that's funner for me. But like that's that was the, the the thing that made him switch what he was gonna do. So Yeah, that joint was yeah. hilarious. He was just so angry, like yeah, he it, was it, it just clicked. Just, it was like, <laughs> like yeah, I'm up. gonna kill you. You gave up your, you mother. <laughs> it, it felt like he wanted to go like that. Yeah, the whole dialogue, and he pulled out the kryptonite, all slow and everything. And la 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 la. What what the, what the heck is that? I know when he picked it up and threw it. Wow, <laughs> that's that's just how you feel, you right? Ruined all my fun. And I was like, yeah, oh, yeah, you, you, you was pissed. You. And I liked I liked every minute of it. It was yeah. hilarious. The fight scene between Superman and Superman was that. So, um, no, nothing. It, it was wasn't nothing. Special. It was nothing. Nah. I mean, uh, I'm pretty sure they all saving it for the final fight scene with Arrow. Because he'll be there. Or at least like last year's crossover when they all had him out there. That was pretty cool. Their fight scenes and then yeah, Flash Arrow was running, that too. And then some flying. And then, oh man, that was so cool. Because Supergirl fought Supergirl last season and last season's crossover. Oh, we all did. And so this year they said Superman versus Superman on this one. So, it, you know, it's pretty cool. When did she fight Supergirl? Was it last crossover or the crossover we, before? The crossover, crossover before. before. The crossover yeah. before. You were just. It was a crossover man. before. This Batman yeah. lost his marbles. He's just killing everybody on. Hey. He realized with every other Batman should realize, even though I don't condone what he was doing, every other Batman should realize these guys are going to keep coming out. They're going to keep killing people. I might as well kill them. Now, Superman, I don't agree with yeah. because he, I now that he was bad and they didn't tell us. No, he. they said he was just letting them do what they were doing. He was just a Boy Scout, pretty much. Yeah. So he was doing what in every other universe Batman is doing, where you capture him. You know they're getting out, just like in the Harley Quinn. I'll uh, I'll come free you tonight as Batman's behind her. That's just what he do. It's I mean, you he knows they're gonna get out. Like like you said before, he should have his own special uh, things to protect. You know, special things to protect him from getting out. But oh, he, it, my number one goal is Gotham has to adopt the death penalty. You have to go with the times at some point. If people keep coming out and filling up graveyards. They that's why. That's why this Batman said, "Look, he took your position. They're not going." No, to mine was a government room. position. I His mean, but a... if they don't have it, you got to do it yourself. Do you know why they don't send them to the death penalty? Because they don't send them to prison. They send them to Arkham Arkham because they're saying they're crazy. They're mental. They're yeah. mentally unstable. It's above it's, that. Which is their way of writing in the old death penalty, pretty yeah, much. Right, right. It's I, 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 I get that. They're trying to be I'm just saying. Instead of I'm yeah, saying. yeah, until they send them to prison, and then the prison gets they get taken out of the prison and get put in the suicide squad. Yeah. <laughs> so it's, they found a way. They always find a way. I, I mean, I'm not denying that. What I'm saying is, Gotham. It's so Gotham's like a real city. They should like you know what? We have a death penalty. <laughs> yeah. Look, that should be all super we, super places where superheroes live. There. You're right. It is super that villains. is Gotham. If, if you have people filling graveyards. Of dead people, then, then you are no longer insane. You are making a choice. I don't care what it is. The world is better without without you. I'm just keeping it real. That's just me. Let me move but forward. But comics are better without you. If, if yeah. you are dead, I said if it was a real world, there'd be no comics. You know, you know what? It bad. would. You want to know why? Because writers were getting inspired to make new villains, even better villains. That's how I'm going with it. Daniel's part. That's what Daniel say. Yes, it would. You just bring about <laughs> new villains. Thank you. So that's what we need. Yeah. So that with that being said, just don't bring Kite Man. That, that was great. That yeah. was hilarious. My Look, man thought Kite he was, Man knows who he was. Oh, the wind trajectory. He he is the hmm. coolest, smoothest. No, he's not in his own mind. In his own oh, mind. Okay, okay. He is the coolest. Better wait for the guy finish. Ever. Okay. All right, but going back to Crisis or Infinite Earth <laughs> Part Two. Uh, it's, it feel like they, they took a little bit of Scott Snyder's, I mean, Zack Snyder's Batman from uh, Batman vs. Superman. Because he said, I forgot what line, he said one line that was like directly out the movie. I can't think of it. I don't remember. I, I, know, I, I should have wrote it down. <laughs> but at the time, I was dealing with a crisis in my house. So, Infinite Rooms. It's it was, a lot, it was a lot happening. It was on Infinite Rooms. Yeah. <laughs> the one in the living well, room, anyway, the Kate, dining room. Kate the beat room. Batman, yeah. killed him. Yeah. And I'm gonna find out she's them. the courage. She's the Paragon of courage. I knew that was coming the whole time. I mean, yeah, yeah. I did too. I don't know, but yeah. if he doesn't know pretty much what's going on anymore, he's still the monitor. He still seems like he's 
manipulating what's going on. So he's manipulating. No, nah, he's losing his powers. I mean, we but know he's that. still. But he can still, you know, motivate people to yeah. be do what he wants. Yeah. No, well, motivate them and do what they want. Do what he wants them to do, and bring out their inner superhero in them, the, the, the best of them. Like Kara got her hope back in the, in, the, in that same in that same situation. I don't Both know of how them she got her hope back that quick. <laughs> Your whole galaxy got destroyed. Where her hope now is well, she's I'm the paragon of hope. So I mean, but at the beginning of the episode, she had no hope at all. I would too. She, she, found, she found. I lost my home. mom. Exactly, that's what I'm saying. My people, the, my adopted people, yeah. my adopted mom. Yeah. I lost it all. But when she saw the book, she saw hope. She was like, "Oh, there's a possibility." Like you brought Lex Luthor mm-hmm. back, and I know he was dead. I know he's dead. You brought him back because of the book. I have hope that the book can bring back. Now, my hope Kate looks like she's about to try to stop Supergirl from doing that. Uh, no, I think Kate is adopting. I, she's adopting that Batman. I need to keep this with me at all times, just in case yeah. you go rogue. Right. And if it's but not, she is about to go rogue. Well, if it's not her, then the other Superman. You you still got the other ones. You got two other Superman. You got two other. That's that's, that's, that's more than one. Enough. More than lost everything. Yeah. yeah, I can't believe he's not the embodiment of hope. Is that dude? He lost it all. He's like, yeah, I lost people here, my wife. Okay, I'm like. Oh, you just keep losing? Yeah. And you all smiling? And have, no, bump that. You got to move on in life. You got to move on. Yes. You can't You can't stay depressed forever. Nah, you you're right. If you do, what's the point of you even living? Hey, look, everything you're saying is right. I might have. It would, <laughs> I feel like you would have just stabbed yourself with some... No, I would have stabbed him. And whenever I had Superman powers, I would, it would have been like injustice. So you became a villain. You would have took over the world. I would have became a lead villain. The villain. The villain. I would have oh, wow. became a lead villain. You were talking about the exact same the thing villain. we said about I villains. I said I would become a leader. The villain. Villains think they're leaders. Whether you think my methods are not or right. He's, that's, that's what super villains say. Or that's what leaders say. A lot of leaders are bad. Hey, brother. I'm telling you what I'm saying. Leader. I would have been a leader by force. Oh, oh, there or, it is. There it or is. by your agreement. But either way, I'm gonna be a leader. So if you agree with me, this won't happen die? again. This won't. It won't happen again under. What does that attack. sound like? You agree with me or you die? Sounds like a leader. Get down or lay down. <laughs> no. They lead. No. Get down or lay down. I will lead. Simple it. as that. What you want to do? I'm a leader. That's wow. what it sounds like to me. Thug life. No. 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 It's the only life I have. <laughs> Big trust. Hey. <laughs> here, go the, here go the big thing that happened that he was talking about at the beginning. They put Arrow in the Lazarus pit. Ugh. He came out without his soul. And they can't get his soul. He can't get it. Hopefully they don't get his soul back. Whoa, brother. Whoa, man. Look what. Like, so like, like I said at the beginning, if, you, stay if, dead. if you're dead, you might you as well stay dead. dead. You stay dead. Simple as that. There's no exceptions to the rule with me. Uh, don't worry. All right. With you, it is. With him, I already got him on the Black Lightning video. But that's neither in nor there. Uh... <laughs> yeah, I don't yeah. know. Don't worry, because you say you say the same thing. You just say that he said the same thing. So I got that. I take care of that in the video right after this. Make sure y'all go check that out. But Arrow has to. He can't. He can't. He, I know it's a double standard. I know this. Let Arrow live, man. Let him be in the final fight scene, man. And then you can kill him. He can die more of a hero. Saving a billion people, that's a good hero. It's saving, though. That's a good going out. Still, party. saving, I don't know what the, the next thing is after trillions is. So whatever that is, because you're saving mul- different multiverses, all have trillions in it. That is, I, I mean, they will talk, They will. your name will be ringing out forever. Forever. All right, we finally got the first look at the anti-monitor. Yeah, and, finally. Uh, yeah, uh, he's already recruited uh, Harbinger, Harbinger, so which have kind of happened in the comic. It ha- happened differently, so I want to know: Are they gonna? Uh, oh, they're not. They're not. I'm gonna say if they do, then you, we know how many people dying. Well, not because she she got infected. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> she got infected by the anti monitor in the comics. I forgot. But, oh, I forgot how. I think one of his minions infected her somehow. So, some stupid. Some voices are talking to her right now. That's some, how it's happening now. That's how it's yeah. So now I want to know: Is she actually gonna? Fight them all, or she gonna betray? And if she betray them, then the monitor know and already set it in motion like this is part of the plan. Mm-hmm. Brilliant, I know. He's getting sm- he's getting stronger with every death of a universe. So 
and Amari is getting weaker. Yeah, so it's um, it's looking good on his uh, for him. <laughs> As it should. As of right now, it looks like he's gonna win. Yeah, that's what As I'm of saying. Right now, Andy Monitor is in a good position. God dang, Monitor took forever to get everybody together and stuff. You know, I always think when I see these things, it's like, where are the universal uh, heroes, like the Green Lanterns? Like, can I get a Green Lantern somewhere? You like, can't. the space heroes yeah. and stuff? Yeah, yeah that, that ain't gonna happen. I mean, he got a point, but it ain't gonna happen. Yeah, it ain't gonna happen. You ain't just my, no. let that go. We, we all know why. We're not, even gonna get in, not even gonna get into it. We all know why. There are people above him. Yeah. Everybody is like, you can't do it. You can't use them. You're not allowed. You're not allowed. They stopped no everyone from using the Suicide Squad. Yeah. Oh, they, they, oh, they shut that down. <laughs> so... Let's just and it, and that would have worked for his show. Yeah, it would have too. So you just let it go. Just don't even let, let not even bring that up. Let's just bring Arrow back to life, mm. fully intact with yeah, the soul. That's already let him happened. lead the team. They, they already started this. We already knew it when he died. Well, yeah, yeah we knew. It. I didn't. I, I, I was, really? I was his daughter. Da- his daughter is exactly like him. She wasn't letting that go. She it's was. the CW curse. If you were, if you're important to me, oh, we're finding a way to bring you back. Yeah. Hey, I'm everybody not, else in these other universes, I'm not denying. I'm I'm like, just, everybody just, else has been through the Lazarus pit. His sister, yeah. he could, he, he didn't know to do it with his mom. His his dang our girlfriend, his other girlfriend. Why not him? Why not? And it's already been done. So here you go. Just a matter of whether or not Constantine can give him his soul back or not. And it don't look like it's going to happen anytime soon. We'll see what happens. Let's see if they keep it a secret to everybody else. Yeah, I hope they do. Then lock them in a lock them in a know, dang Barry, cell or something. Barry's not Barry's not the one for secrets. Barry is very much the one for secrets. Barry, Barry started off like every <laughs> season secrets. with secrets. Every him secret. him and Dag on uh, 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 Candace Patton. What's her name? Iris. Iris. Yes. Iris. See, tell her every time. Yeah. Let's keep this uh, between us. Until, not, we, until uh, we have to say it. Like, yeah, until we have to tell And then, like, at the end of the episode, he tells everybody. Yeah, but he always starts so off in, keeping in the, the secret. In the fourth one, he's going to tell everybody yeah. when, when it feels like there's no hope. We, we know we, what it is. We thought we could do it ourselves. We, oh. were, on, we were doing it for the greater good. Yeah. It didn't work out. We need your help. It didn't work out. <laughs> That's it. That's it. What you guys rate this episode? I'm giving it an eight. Um... I would, I would give it a nine. They would let people say dead that who, who are not Arrow. They weren't talking about bringing. Oh yeah, we could bring this back and we could bring him that. Like I could bring back Earth thirty eight. Let's not do that. Al, yeah. what you rate this episode? So, I wasn't double my soliloquy because we, we Arrow didn't... needs to be alive. I gave it a seven point five. Ooh. I mean, it's the fact that Arrow, even though we knew he was coming back, but everybody's like we have this huge old crisis. But forget this crisis. Let's just bring one person back. I mean, and like you said, my thought is everybody should stay dead. And it, to me, it feels like they're trying to find a way to bring everybody back. And yeah, I'm that's like, what heroes do. If this is a crisis crisis, <laughs> save what you can now. Don't sit up this show. I mean, you, you worry about bringing everybody back after the fact. But it seems like the crisis took a second hand half of this episode. It's, that's a lot of loss it took. It's a lot of loss. So you need to try to get the guy, not, oh, let's just bring this one person back, uh, except for Carl. Oh, I want to bring my whole planet back. And I have the way. And everybody else, oh, let's just bring Arrow back. I don't care about nothing else. This is top priority. No, the top priority is the people who destroyed all these planets. But it is what it is. That's what happens with CW shows. It's it's, it's, it's what it always is. Let's forget everybody else that could die. Let's just bring this one person back because he, he's the only reason. He's the that reason we, that can save everything. Bring Arrow back. No. You're right. No. If you have four people with superpowers, one guy who just shoots arrows isn't going to do it. The leadership. Nothing. The leader. We're going back to leadership. I'm sorry. Being a leader. Arrow. I'm, I'm, I'm keeping it real with the fact that it's if, if it's not super consequences, like you say, like at the beginning, the first episode, I loved it because Arrow died. I wasn't expecting it. And I was like, it doesn't count damn. because Arrow died. Okay, I told you it's a double Look, standard. I'm not wavering from that point. I know I'm wrong. I understand that, but this is double my standard. opinion. Like Your opinion, you always your opinion say, is a, like what hey, you look, always say, keep the consequences. You're absolutely right. Now I'm being the leader. Follow my lead. No, all right. This no. is gonna be injustice, Superman. No, Arrow. Dan, a lie. You, Dan, you. What do you think? Uh. I gave this episode uh, probably a 7.3. Mm-hmm. The monitor is just getting on my nerves knowing <laughs> that everybody is who... He knows who they were when they, when yeah. they recruited everybody. Mm-hmm. 
him wanting them to go figure it out for themselves is like I understand why he did. I just don't want to see it. <laughs> I didn't want to see it. Right. It's, it's, it's kind of like that thing. If I tell you what's going to happen, yeah, I understand. Then it won't that. Happen. No, I understand that, but still, it's just like, oh my god. And who are the other pair? Of de- we got, he got to go still get the other people. Got seven of them, and he got what four now? Yeah, three more. Yeah, I was. Like, man, man, come on, let's let's pick, let's pick this up a little. Yeah, it was slow, but it the was dialogue slow. was good. So I mean, I like when Lex Luthor ran into the Smallville Clark Kent. Yeah, that was cool to see. But when Clark, when Superman fought Superman, I was like, this is underwhelming. This isn't what I expected. Well, one is holding back. Well, we know one was holding back for sure, but the other one, who is. All that anger, like that's a lot of anger. He should have been off the rip. Just he should have hit him so hard that the whole the whole building collapsed. Like Jesus. But and then they should have been hit Lex Luthor as soon as he opened yeah, the book. It was like this the whole right. time. But he wasn't the distracted book. though. Uh, huh? If he has the book, he was. Has... He was looking directly at both the Superman kill each other, and they were all looking through the window the whole time. I would have stopped looking at that fight too. Yeah. Like, oh, they fighting each other. She was like, "Get him, husband! Get him!" I was like, "Your husband knows what he's doing. He's been Superman for a while. He'll be okay. <laughs> you got him. You need to go you get got that. this. You need that. to go get that. Book I've never seen Superman fight Superman. I'm gonna look at it a little bit. I'm like. Oh, oh, oh. Yeah, we ain't got time for that. No, I ain't got time for that. Because you don't want to find out that Kingdom Come Superman is stronger than your husband. And you'll be like, oh, shoot, let me do something now. <laughs> yeah. Right. Yeah. Now let me go to Lex Luthor and yeah. try to get the no, book. Yeah. That's when you be like, you know what? I might be okay with you dying. If I got this Kingdom Come, he's mature. And, he understands. He's a little stronger. Yeah, he's being brainwashed right now. We ain't got time for that. Right. Go, go hit I Lex Luthor over the head. And then him using right. Lex Luthor the whole time and everything. This oh, episode he, was a seven. Yeah, he point played three. his part, and I knew what his part was. Yeah, and, yeah, yeah. This episode, it was, was brilliant. And nah. then they gave the baby to Dangal Rory. I was like, Yeah, you're just gonna give your baby to Rory? You don't know Rory. And tell him to go somewhere. As yeah, and then be, and then be going. Here. Going. I was my, like, My kid was. I was like, for turning into a Legends oh, yeah. episode so quick, and I am got not, no problem. With and that. I am not. I'm not a big fan of the Legends. Like. Up, th- that's their clearly their humor and everything. Yeah, yeah. hold the punch back out. You, no, no. Oh. <laughs> the legends, the legends, I, legends are nobody. No. <laughs> legends, that, and they don't even, they even. I give them credit for not wanting to be a part of this whole crossover. That's the only thing I think. Because it's, it's probably too serious for them. It is. It's too serious for them, you know? It's too serious for them. It's too serious. And what's his name? And, um, uh, they disrespect the legends. You know what? Second best show on C on the Arrow verse. We're done here now. You guys, you guys leave comments in the comment by section that. below. It's way Come good. at me. It's way, yeah. What is the best show in the Arrowverse now all of Arrow. a sudden? Still Arrow. Until the season is over. It's Arrow. Top three. Name the top three uh, shows the Arrowverse. Also tell us how you felt about Arrow, Legends of Tomorrow, Super Crisis Girl. on Infinite Earths Part 2. Let us know what you think is going to happen in the next episode because it should be picking up real quick after this one. And uh, what do you think uh, role Black Lightning will play in the next one before mm-hmm. it happens? Good question. And next, until next time, guys, we are out. Deuces. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We in the club, we party. We in the club, we party. How much ice yeah. you got? Yeah, how much ice you got? I don't know. Get it, nah. all this man. I cannot miss like I am the ace I'll let you keep you dinner, leave you with aftershock Getting angry, then I turn to incredible hog Bite and bog, chop it down like you one of them stars